Welcome to Gumby's Exposés, to peek behind the curtain to see what's really going on. Hi, everyone. Today, we're going to look behind the curtain at this recent Ford Bronco commercial. Yeah, there we go. It's massive. It's like way longer stretch than I was expecting to see. The thing you're going to love about this place is the rock. It's <laughs> such good rock. Hands are itching. Yeah. <laughs> Nice, Jimmy, go get it. Nice, Jimmy. I'm excited. I am um, have a lot of adrenaline right now. Coming in hot. Coming in hot. <laughs> it's amazing how beautiful the climbing is, and you know that this rock is like quality. I had so much fun, I want to do it again. <laughs> Okay, let's break it down. First, how many professional climbers can afford a rig like Jimmy Chin is driving? Well, according to Rock and Ice magazine, aside from a few recognizable names, most professional climbers earn less than $10,000 per year. To be exact, 58% of them earn less than $5,000 annually. Good luck with those car payments. And what's up with leaving the headlights on while you're climbing? You'll have to use your drone battery to jumpstart your truck. <laughs> and look at this. Anyone who's climbed at the Gunks will recognize this location. But what's missing? The crowds. This is what that spot usually looks like. They picked a perfect day to shoot this commercial when there wasn't a soul around. Because who in their right mind would climb in those miserable conditions when they could be sitting in the brow house having a beer? Busted. Well, that's it for today, but be sure to tune in for the next episode of Gumby's Exposés. <laughs>